Yo, what plant is that? What plant is hey, that? Hey, what plant is that's that? That's a pretty flower. What plant is that? G. What? What is that? That's neat. Greetings. Here we have bird eye speed whale. Scientific name Veronica persica. This plant is in the edible and medicinal category, but is a, but it is valued primarily for its medicinal value. But edibly, it can be drunken in teas and cooked in soups, and the tender shoots can be used raw in salads. The leaves and flowers can be made into teas for respiratory and inflammation conditions like arthritis, rheumatism, and also helps digestive issues like diarrhea as it is a diuretic and will help you to relieve water from the body. It will increase urination. For sore throats, it is used as a gargle and considered a blood purifier by the gypsies. It is used to remove to remove excess mucus, to increase sweating and add a increase in metabolism and detoxing effect, to soothe the mucosa membranes that are internally in the body, like the mouth, the nose, the esophagus, the stomach, the colon. It's used to treat coughs and clear sinus congestion, asthma, pleurisy, which is a swelling of the lining that separates your chest from your lungs and it is considered a tonic for soft tissues as in it tones them and helps them to perform their physical functions in the body also it is used as an eye wash to aid in eyesight and to ease sore eyes you will find this bird eye speed well growing often in yards or disturbed soils. It has egg shaped toothed leaves. Generally comes in four petals, in a four petal flower that has violet vertical veins and it's like a blue violet flower with a white center. This plant contains chlorophyll as green plants generally do and it's high in antioxidants and vitamin C and it has been externally used to aid in the clearing of rashes and as the name consists speed well it is generally given as gifts or for people who are suffering current conditions that they may heal quicker this has been bird eye speed well hope it has been informative peace if you have any existing health concerns Take that into consideration. If you are taking any medications at this time, take that into consideration and allow a two to three hour window before consuming plants medicinally. Do not take anything that you are not sure of or that you have not properly identified. If you have any further concerns, do not consume the plant. If you would like to know what other medical implications may come about from going back to a more natural life to a more traditional lifestyle after you have properly identified and know the uses of plants thoroughly and you are still concerned, of course, consult your local drug dealing doctor. I love